Houston, say again, please. Uh, Houston, we've had a problem. Hey there folks, welcome you all to part 5 of Kingdoms of Amalur, Re-Reckoning on the Xbox Series X. We are exactly where? Then in part 4. And we are... Well, we're going to head, like I said at the end of the last part, we're going to head to the Salt Farmer Remains. However, I've put a marker on the map for this particular set first, because it's on the way to Barton. And then we'll get these, these ones on the way back. Oh yeah, that's him on the bridge. So yeah, so we need to get these ones on the way back. It makes some form of set. Mind you, it's probably... Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. We can always dive across at that point and get these last remains. Uh, oh, they're not remains. That's the former... Yeah, that's the remains there. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so that's why. So we're going to go there, going to get Barton, going to go back round, and then we should... Get friendly with the Canna Rock Village. Oh, that's just a house, isn't it? Oh, the music in this game is so beautiful. It's actually a very soothing game to play, apart from when the spiders jump out. Gonna jump out anytime soon, I can feel it. Big chest over there, they're gonna be guarding it. Maybe not. A lot of white circles around us, haven't we? What's that one up there? Find the other remains. Oh! <laughs> There's one there as well. Well, we might as well get it while we're here. Totally didn't see that one, did I? Somewhere to discover. Have we already discovered? Oh, hello. Cathras. Bastard. Give me some room, guys. Come on. Everybody calm down. Oh, look at that. Body in the web. Nasty way to go, dude. I feel your pain. So, we can teleport back here if we need to. Catharus discovered. Spiders! Really?
Ooh, they're better than what we're wearing. They're fire as well. Let's put them on. Three of six discovered. Right, I want to go that way now, don't we? God, else. Seriously, rats and skeletons working together? What's that all about? I haven't seen rats for a while. Whoa. No. Okay, what's going on here? <laughs> oh, fucking hell. Right, okay. Holy shit. Fuck. Got those fucking wasp things coming at me. Oh, they got blocked by the tree just that time. One thing at a time. Boosh. Nice. Ooh, 53. We're going to have to put the... Oh, yeah, we didn't put our armor on, did we? It's got a socket in it as well. Still not as good. Although they've got sockets in them, so we could make them better. But not really at the minute. We've not got the skills to be making anything decent. Bennett. Right, well, it's time to go to the uh, slightly less awesome looking armour. <laughs> it still looks good, but I mean, these, these are unique stuffs that we've got on. But we can't ignore the armor that's on these things now. In fact, we can put the Pathfinders on as well, which is 25 as opposed to 14. Plus 8% critical hit damage, plus 10 health, plus 8% damage versus beasts and constructs. Nice. So. Might as well dump the rest. That's 53 and 53, but that's got a socket, so might as well keep that one. Still decent, like. I still like the look of it. We get a different form of leather later on. Might as well keep them on for now. They're slightly better. Well, we've lost all the perks anyway. Well, we've got a bit of health regen on them. It's only point 0.1, but it's more than anything else has got for us at the minute, so I might keep them on for now. Change them in a bit. Squire's boots. Yeah. Critical hit chances on those. Critical hit damage. Yeah, just stick them on. That'll do for now. So what was it? Just the gloves, isn't it? I think. Oh, and the legs.
We're not getting the health regen on that with those legs. So we mustn't get any of the perks if we haven't got the whole set on. Unless it's just so slow that I'm not seeing it. It's definitely stopped because we were getting regen before without any shadow of a doubt. Which means we might as well stick those on. Just make sure there's nothing next to us that we can actually get while we're here. It's not really. Head to the marker, Stephen. Missed it. Too far away. Ooh, it's ominous. Oh, hello. Yeah, face down. Nice. Thank you. The embrace of Webwood never ends. It grips you with a strength of passion, a gentle stillness, a quiet moment. Sleep in this cradle of a little tiny bit of sunshine coming through there. Oh. <laughs> I'm there. Totally cut the sound out of the nice story. Oh, never mind. Hombres. There we go. Fire this time, though. Another face stone. you take so are you taken hold me in your love and i hold you in my own borrow me and i will borrow you of kind a kind of kindness and forever a chill to comfort the warm two more to go Right, let's go see Barton. Shade River Caves. Hello, Barton Begets. <laughs> nice.
Here we go. Oh, there's a few of them coming. Ten against seven. Could have put them on there and then, really, couldn't I? <laughs> I'm actually enjoy. I actually prefer this armor. I think now. <laughs> now I've just said that about it not looking as funky. Oh, blimey, I've lost my bearings. That's where we came in, so we'll be going back on ourselves if we go that way. Yeah, that's another way around, I think. We shall have to come back. I think it's just a jumping ledge at the end of here. Yeah. And that'll just take us back out again, so this way. Steve. Another jumping point. To where we've just been, I think. Stop button. What's up, my friend? Stay back. Wait. An army. By the widow's mercy, who sent you? Have you word from Canarok? I was sent to find your party. I'm the only one left. My men and I were ambushed when we entered the cave. It's as if the damn spiders set a trap for us. These spiders are somehow using strategy, tactics. Simple ones, but enough to overwhelm us. I think, I think someone is leading them. It's all <clears throat> in the cave. Footprints, torn webs, but no body. It could be the bloody widow for all I know, but Canarot needs to be told. Garner has betrayed you. That damn 
This whole suicide mission was his idea. And now he tries to have me killed? I need to tell Kanarok what has happened here, and deal with Garena. I have to hurry. Speak with me after we reach Kanarok. Seems reasonable. Please. Speak with me, please. Ooh, Assassin's Aegis. Well, what does that do? I haven't actually got a necklace on, have I? Plus 10% physical damage versus heavily wounded enemies. Oh, better than nothing. Equip. I love that. It's still burning away as you come back through the webbing. That's where we came in, isn't it? Hey, quickest route. Oh, there's, <laughs> there's Barton there. He's gone that way around. Which, to be fair, is probably the quickest route anyway. Jump down, jump down, all the way around. Yeah, yeah. Go, go left, Steve. Jeez, I hope they fix this bug with the sprinting because it's winding me right up. Especially at times like this, we want to get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here. Right, well, we've got a couple of remains to find, haven't we? And then we can go back. Dispel chest. If it's not eve it's not very easy, I'm not doing it. <laughs> well, it's easy. <sighs> Tell you what. Shall we cheat a bit? You see, I can't do it, people. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, what's the manual save? It has to be that one, doesn't it? I mean, seven seconds to reload the game, you know what I mean? Ugh. What is wrong with me? <laughs> I've got, I need the practice people is what I need. One more try and then we'll go in. That's painful if you're actually playing it on the older consoles. You sit there waiting for it to load up. I mean, that's not easy, is it? How is that easy? Nah, I don't get it. You've got to hit it on the mon on the money as well. Plus two Ooh, mana regen, though take that action. In fact, I'll probably take that rather than the extra health and mana. This isn't my mana regen anyway. Actually, plus 10% plus health I could probably live without for now.
Hey, right, where are we going? We're going to... Meet Agarth. Investigate, yeah, that's all very different places. Right, find the remains. That's one there. And one there, so yeah. On to the cross. Fucker, where do you come from? Well, we'll be getting a bit of XP at the end of all of this because we've got a fair few quests to sort out and hand in. It's funny, when you're actually looking for a spider to do the quest, you can't find one. The minute you've got them all, they come out of everywhere. On the other side. Rest the remains. Get rid of that. Get rid of that marker. Well, I might as well give you your stuff while you're here. Hello. Brought them. Thank the gods. My store was almost out. But with these, I can create a fresh batch. Please, take these. I'll be able to make more shortly. Excellent. Have you any spare potions? Here's a bottle. <laughs> Thank you. Have you any spare potions? I do not. Oh, well. Sorry, but never mind. I need more time to prepare them. And... What does she have in there? It's just potions, isn't it? Yeah. Yes, we need to empty our inventory, but we'll do it with none. What's needed now? Get the rest of the remains behind somewhere. Hang on. Hang about. This ossuary looks as though it has seen better days. However, it would be a fitting place to rest the bones of the, the dead silk farmers you found in the webwood. Place the remains. <gasps> God, look how close we are to a level up. <laughs> Should get it when we speak to the other guy. Hmm. 
That leaves a tangled web, I think. Oh, Grim Harvest. Do that first. Let's go and see... Oh, I've forgotten the name now. Toff. Is it Penry Toff? Something like that. She is... What can I help you with? Oh, no, I've got to confront him first. Cartery Jack. Cartery Jake. So, the saviour comes for Cartery. What do you want? I found this dagger at Toff Farm. You did? I, I must have left it behind when I was fleeing those spiders. The damn things were everywhere. I can see you're not convinced. So that Toff brat sent you to do a little digging. <laughs> It was only a matter of time before she learned what I did to her parents. But you found out first. A stroke of luck. Now, let's come to an arrangement, shall we? Say, a heavy purse for your silence? Why did you kill them? Carowin and I fought at the gates of Mel Senshir years ago. We deserted before we saw our second battle. When we came here, she invited me to join her and her husband Imer and their daughter on that farm. It was a simple life. I thanked the gods for it. Then Carowin and Ima decided to return to the war and bring me with them. When they insisted, I used the only skill war ever taught me. No deal, you're going to pay. Really? The wandering hero is going to bring me to justice? I think not. I've murdered twice before, and you shall be my third. I don't think so, mate. That's done. Nice. Level up time. Return to Menry. Do I level up first, shall we? Level up and ride your pony. Still can't go any higher there. Need net. We need to be at least level eight. So we'll do some more persuasion, I think. Bribe costs for crime. Increase your chance to persuade others. Yeah, I think I did put stuff into the Sagecraft, though. Better quality shards drop more frequently. You can create powerful gems using Lambent quality shards, yeah. I think I did do that, actually, rather than Persuasion. I think I put a couple on Persuasion, but then Sagecraft, because I wanted gems. I don't know. Too much to choose from. If you spread yourself too thin, you're kind of master of none. Uh, you can salvage infrequent items. You can use four components when crafting equipment. I'm, uh, I'm going to do one more. Increase your chance to persuade others of your way of thinking. Just bribe, bribes and persuasion in it. Better quality shards drop more frequently. Yeah, because they they become well handy those things. Right. I think the next jump up in finesse armor is a 13, possibly. And we're on 8. Let's max out the chakrams. Yeah, daggers and chakrams both sorted. 25% elemental damage, 10% less. Yeah, that's a better one, isn't it? Right, Menry Toff it is. Oh, hello. What is it? Hey, Menry. I can't believe Cartery killed them. 
My mother and father had been his friends for years, before I was even born. To think that he did all this just to avoid the war. I knew my family was likely dead, but I thought it wouldn't be over something like this. Thank you for your help. Here, here is your reward, as promised. 756 gold, shit. Oh, silk farmer gloves, yes, I wear those. I do wear those, as it happens, if I'm allowed. Safe journey. Marvellous. God damn it. <laughs> I knew there was a reason I wanted to put my points into finesse. Right, we'll hang on to those, because I definitely use them for a while. Huge jump up on the ones we're wearing as well. Right, points into finesse next. Let's get up to 14 at least. Right, something's next to us. What is it? Tangled web, brutal contract, overgrown thicket, Camden's fate. Tangled web, it must be. No, it's not though. Oh no, there's that thing, isn't there? What's needed? Oh, she was out for a walk as well. God damn it. Oh, I bet she's gone back in her house now. Oh, she's not. Till's collection. Lovely. I'll take the book and no more, because it's only going back to its rightful place. Hello. God, that was lucky, wasn't it? She just came back in. <laughs> Hello. Oh, it's Barton. Hello, Barton. Part in saving me, you have my thanks. Oh, I've got a house. Yes. You're welcome to Gossamer End, a house in the village. Billis Ade, the town blacksmith, will make repairs if you need them. For his treachery, I have banished Garana from this town. The widow take him. Enjoy your new home, but do so quickly. If the widow is out there, we must send someone to Castle Yorvin to find out why. The widow is a quest of its own. What's needed from Castle Yolven? Information. Castle Yolven was a fey bastion long ago. They used some form of the magic to pacify Webwood. Perhaps they can tell us how to calm Webwood. Hey. Okay. Must have got the quest already, have I? Oh. Uh. That's weird. Why is... Uh, come here. Oh, cutting the threads. There we go. <laughs> I was going to say, where's the quest? I was too quick for the game, people. That's what happened there. Goss, Amaren... Well, yeah. We're going to upgrade it, actually. See the one that upgrades it? There's a lot I need to do, stranger. So if you've come on business, you should make it quick. The forge is hot if you need to use it, and I have a few items I can spare, but we'll need them soon enough, I'm sure. Aid. Don't even know how to pronounce that name. Billis Aid. House upgrade, please. I'd be happy to fix up old Gossamer End for you. That place could use some expansion. I can put in a dining area for some gold. What do you say? A. I... Well, let me know if you are. Stay alert. Before I do that, actually, just for anyone that hasn't seen Gossamer End be before you upgrade it, <laughs> might be useful. So when you first get it, you've just got this one room effectively, and there's our chest for you put put all your stuff in there and store it that you're not using, and.
You can't see your junk in here, can you? Uh, no, you can't. So you can put whatever you want in your chest, basically, and take it out again. I'm just going to... Might be easier said than done, but... I'm just going to put all that in my chest. Not that I need it, but just want to hang on to it for prosperity's sake. So, I can now store all of that in there. In fact, we can store the Silk Farmer gloves in there until we're ready. Twin Souls. Well, yeah, we don't need them anymore either. That's interesting. You can't put the Maiden's Ring in there. wonder if it's a quest type item. Oh, well, it is a quest item, isn't it? It's just we didn't give it to her. So we should be able to put it in there, but we can't. You can junk it, but you can't store it. That's might store those as well. Just for the sheer sake of it. And that's it. So that's what it is when you first come in. You can also change your appearance here. I think it's just the look, though. Yeah, face and hair. You can't change your name or origins or uh, sex or anything like that. Gender. Right, now let's upgrade it. We should better do it all in a one to be fair. Hello, stranger. Whoa. So he's set up his blacksmiths in the pub. It's quite good, isn't it? Garner or Barton? I don't know which one would have led us out of this alive. Of those of us that are still around. All I know is I need to close up the windows, check the cellar, and pray the spiders don't find the cracks in the shingling. House upgrade? I can fix up old Gossamer End for you. That place could use some expansion. I can put in a dining area for some gold. What do you say? Do it. We'll be ready in no time. Let me know if you want any further expansion. House upgrade? Well, it sure would be useful to have an alchemy workbench. I can add a room with one for some gold. Do it. The alchemy workbench should come in handy in these neck of the woods. House upgrade? The main floor has been expanded as much as possible, but I can squeeze in an attic for some gold. Do it. You'll be amazed when you see that attic. Uh, house upgrade? But I can add on a basement for some gold. Do it. I'll go ahead and set up the basement with some plants and reagents. You'll love it. And house upgrade? In more storage space, I can expand your basement for some gold. Do it. Be careful when you go in there. Somehow a spider got in when I was doing the last upgrade. <laughs> That's good, isn't it? Just left it there, did you? I can do one last expansion of the basement, give you more space for the plants down there, for some gold. Do it. This will be the last upgrade I can give you. I hope you like everything I've done. Excellent. Uh, should we repair my kit while we're here? Might as well. Fare you well. Why is the quest not finishing? There you go, quest complete. <laughs> Sounded a bit Greek in there for a minute. That music. Uh, where's my house, people? Now it looks like it is. Alchemy Lab, of which we haven't done anything yet. Minor Alchemist Art. All. I 
thought you could do a... Oh, there we go. I thought you could just do a random one and see if it worked. Sure you can. Just put two things together and see what happens kind of thing. Ah, oh, there we go. Experiment. Causes a random effect to occur. This effect may potentially be good or bad. <laughs> An hombres and a white flake. <laughs> I have no idea what I've created. Easy. Unstable potion. <laughs> well, you know. I think we'll add those to the junk. Right. So, yeah. So that's what the main room looks like now. There's a chest still there. You've got a dining area. Statues and all sorts. And then put the basement in. Plants growing. Reagents. You did say there was a spider going, but not seeing it. And we can make our gems in here. I think we had a couple of slots, didn't we? Poison damage. Physical damage. What about armor gems? Plus eight armor. Yeah, plus eight armor. So we can make some some good some good gems to put in our armor. Well, basic ones at the minute. Black cohosh. Oh, and upstairs, in case you wanted to see it. The master bedroom, and that's where you can change your appearance now. You can forward time here as well. I mean, you can use any of these to store stuff in, I guess. That's not true, actually. I just made that up. So, just the chest downstairs. There's some gold there, though. Might as well take it. Now, I'll keep it for a rainy day. <laughs> so, there you go. If you ever wondered what Gossamer looked like, all done up. We have a house, people! Right, what quest are we on with? Well, we might as well, I suppose, do the, the next part of the... Well, we, the idea was to get the the house. Cutting threads is going to turn into the journey of who's controlling the spiders. It's quite a good one, actually. We'll do that. Brutal contract. Locate the former contract holder. Right, that was nearby, actually, I think. Let's go and see if we can get that done. There was a couple kicking around the area. Yeah, it's just over there, isn't it? Actually, no. I think this involves killing about five trolls or something, doesn't it? <laughs> Unless I'm completely mistaken.
Investigate Essenmere and Gentle Beasts Overgrown Thicket. Camden's Fate. Well, Camden's Fate is... God damn it. Iron Hold Passage. I was actually looking for a couple of smaller things that we could have done in this part. What about tasks? Brother Till has loaned out his private library. Yeah, oh, that's just the books. So, yeah, it is what it is. According to a contract from Children Keep, a valuable book was lost in the overgrown thicket. Okay, let's just give that a whirl. See how we go. Why do I feel like I'm going the wrong way? I'm not, though. Back to the hut. Arn's hut. Well, the bears are back. I love that grapple hook, although it's not called a grapple hook, I know, but... Uh. Actually, that's a good point. How have I not got some sort of illness from not dispelling that last one? Yeah, the old thicket's an actual area, isn't it? <laughs> I can't remember how long this quest is. You bugger.
bastard. Ooh, hello. Plus five mana, that's not that good, is it? It's not that good. They are better than what we're wearing. Equip those bad boys. Basic, but better. Yeah, it's not that big an area, is it? That's good. Hello, we get. Oh, they've got bombs. God damn it. Bomb chuckers. That'll do that. It's a beast. Ooh. Ooh, plus one to sorcery abilities. Lovely. Elemental resistances and physical resistances. Well, it's probably better than the one we've got on. Equip. Well, that's well better. Well, it's not got the perks on it, but it's more protection. Stick that on, I think. The Book of Gentle Beasts. Yes, we were meant to empty our inventory, we didn't, did we? And I say we, I mean me. Cool, it's dishing out the necklaces, isn't it? Plus one to might abilities. Well, that's not as useful, though, is it, for us, the build we're on? Well, I'll say that. It does, uh, it does give us an extra one in our... What do you may call it? Our uh, grapple hook thing. But sorcery is by far the better... The better option there for me. Ravenclaw. I wonder if that drops from him every time or whether these things are slightly random. They will drop from an enemy at some point of that kind kind of thing. Right. We've got the book. I think that was a shield and keep one, wasn't it? Oh, for God's sake. I wonder when this bug creeped in. I'd be really interested to see if that is a side effect of another fix or whether it is fine on the Xbox One X. Oh, well, the Xbox One X is what I had because it didn't do this on the Xbox One. The delay, the delay in some of these drops has, has always been there since the beginning of the game. In fact, you can't even pick those up, even though they're shining. Right, let us say... Uh, go to Castle Yolvin. Yeah, we'll do that another time. That's quite a long one, that.
Let's hand it in. I do love this. Very gorgeous. You're welcome in the keep, as long as your honor's intact. I have the lost book. Oh yes, from overgrown thicket, was it? Normally that sort of thing is beneath even contract work. But these days, if the payer has enough coin to spare and is insistent enough, we put it on the board. Yes, take any job you like from the board itself. When a contract's done, return to me. On with you. Marvellous. Well, I think we're about halfway to our next... Yeah, more than halfway to our next upgrade. Not too far from level 8. Well, there we go. I think it's an ideal place to wrap it up. Points into finesse next time, Stephen. Remember. <laughs> Need to put our armour on that's level 14. Yeah, enjoyed that again. Really enjoying bringing more of these to you guys. It has been an honour and a privilege serving for you once again in Kingdoms of Amalur. Re-reckoning on the Xbox Series X. And I shall catch you next time, folks. Take it easy. Bye.